Right there. What up guys, Token Vaping. Um, so today's juice review is the next flavor in a line that I'm actually really, really honored and privileged to be associated with. Um, it is called Invasion, with a Z. And you can actually go to vaporschoice.com, and that's vapors, V-A-P-E-R-Z, choice.com, uh, to purchase these flavors. There is six total. This is their flavor menu. Um, I've already done one, and this is going to be the next the next flavor for that. So if you are interested in any of the flavors that I've done a review on, or if you want to go check out uh, Invasion Liquids on VaporsChoice.com, they're also on Facebook and Instagram, and find out what the flavor profiles are. You can either watch my upcoming videos, or you can check out the flavor profiles on their pages and VaporsChoice.com. On checkout, if you add my name, if you throw my name in uh, Token Vaping, uh, it'll save you 25% off your purchase. So that was a little thank you that they uh, threw out for me doing the review as well. It's a huge, huge honor. So the next flavor that I'm doing is called Dark Star. Now this is the bottle. As you can see, it is sealed. So this is a first fave, first review. Um, it's kind of hard to see the name just, oh, well, no, actually that shows up a bit better than I thought it would, but it's kind of cool because you see how if you shift it in the light, it changes colors from a blue to like a purple. It is Invasion Dark Star, and this line is, to me, is just really cool because I love these logos, their labels. The alien artwork that they have on these are fantastic. Um, you definitely need to check them out. It's just very, very well done. Uh, these are offered in a 0, 3, 6, and 12, and they do come in 30 mil bottles as such. It does have the logo. There is the name of the company, of the line, and the name of the flavor. And then it does have the necessary warning and ingredients label labeling as well. As I said, on this one here, it is a little bit harder to see just because of the darker um, tint that they're going with. But it is a 3. MG with a 30 mil bottle. So we're going to go ahead and bust this open in here. And as always, I do freshly wick. And if you haven't been watching my videos, shame on you. Um, just kidding. The cotton that I use is Texas Tough Cotton. Um, most of the most other cottons that I've tried, this one just works really well for me. It's durable. It holds up really well, with the exception of if I, if I uh, change up flavors a lot. Um, it just, it it holds together a, a bit longer than a lot of other ones that I've tried and it doesn't have a strong cottony taste to it on a first vape so that's one reason why I do like it but on Instagram it is Texas Tough Cotton so we're gonna go ahead and bust this open and while I'm opening this and then I'm gonna go ahead and juice up my cotton just you know just to randomly throw it out there I do say it I try to remind everybody or say it in my videos but you know my opinion is simply just me giving you uh, the flavor profile um, of the liquid and then vaping it and giving you a rough idea of what it, how it comes off for me. I'm not trying to tell you to go completely off of what I say um, because everybody's different. That's what makes this community so amazing is that there's so many diverse people involved. Um, I'm not trying to impose my opinion on anybody. I'm just trying to give you a better inf informative opinion so that it can give you a better idea of if it's something that you want to try or if it's something that, you know, you could suggest to a shop or some friends that, you know, if they like that particular flavor. So I'm just trying to help vapors. Um, so the flavor profile for Dark Star is supposed to be, according to their profile, is um, cinnamon bun sprinkled with a frosted oatmeal cookie crumble. Definitely get the oatmeal. Yep. You get a slight, and I don't know if it's because I just said it, um, there is a very slight hint of the cinnamon bun smell, but it is definitely more of, a, of an oatmeal cookie uh, smell to it. So we're going to go ahead and vape this, and we will see if it tastes more like a cinnamon bun or if it tastes more like an oatmeal cookie because, as I stated, oatmeal is a bit stronger of a flavor in my opinion um, especially when you do like oatmeal cookies they have a very pronounced presence when it comes to flavor profiles and matching it up with a cinnamon bun flavor which is kind of strong on its own it's going to be interesting to see which one kind of takes center stage so depending on your taste preference or your sensitivity to each particular flavor um, might determine which one you taste more of 
I'm going to go ahead and just do a quick little pre-burn. Get the juice going into the cotton and my coils. And I'm going to go ahead and drip a little bit more on. And we are off and vaping. So I'm going to go ahead and cap this. And as always, I am vaping at 75 watts. So this is Dark Star from Invasion Liquids. second and so as you can see the clouds are pretty dense which is always a plus I'm more of a cloud person than I am anything else So I'm going to drip a little bit more since the juice has had a little bit of time now to work through the, the coils a little bit more from a couple of vapes. No throw hit whatsoever, which is really good because that's one thing I'm not a fan of when it comes to vaping. Okay, Dark Star. I don't like oatmeal cookies. I really don't. Um, actually, I'm not much of a cookie eater anyway. However, this has more of a sweet oatmeal cookie taste. Like, I've tried regular plain oatmeal cookies, and I'm not a fan of the flavor of that. But the frosted oatmeal cookie that this is supposed to emulate the frosting aspect of it gives it a nice sweet undertone on the oatmeal you definitely taste oatmeal absolutely I do taste that it is not something that um, is you know it's not super strong it is it is uh, a smooth oatmeal flavor but the frosting is what makes it enjoyable um, the cinnamon bun is more on the undertone so it's kind of I mean for the flavor profile, it's supposed to be a cinnamon bun sprinkled with the frosted cookie, the oatmeal cookie crumble on top. And that's literally, when you vape it, that's the flavor line, lineup, I guess, you you taste. Um, because you definitely get the frosted oatmeal, but you do get the cinnamon bun on the undertone. But it stays well blended throughout the vape. Um, Yeah, that's actually a nice combo. Now, it may not be my first choice in the line uh, just because of the oatmeal. And again, I'm not a huge fan of the oatmeal flavor. But this is a lot more of an enjoyable vape than I honestly thought it was going to be. I really was expecting the oatmeal to be really strong. Um, and then basically assuming that I wasn't going to like it because of that. I, can't, I could actually vape this if... I was looking for something that had a little bit of sweetness to it, but had a hearty vape to it. This definitely is not considered a light or refreshing vape. Um, this is definitely a heartier, you know, like a dessert style vape. Um, but it definitely blends well and is definitely well, well made. Like I said, you get the, the frosted oatmeal cookie layered on top of a cinnamon bun, but it stays that way throughout the entire vape. It doesn't separate. You don't pick out one over the other. Um, it just works really, really well together as as a whole. Um, but regardless of anything else, I mean, if you like dessert style vapes, if you're looking for a heartier vape, if you like um, a sweet with a little bit of, you know, like a either a, a cinnamon sugar or um, a cookie type uh, flavor, this definitely would be something that that would be worth trying. But definitely give them a, give them a, a give them a look. Give them a follow, give them a try. You know, it's definitely an eye-catching label.
on any shelf in any shop. It's definitely going to draw your attention. But definitely check them out. Invasion Liquids. Um, they are on Facebook. They are on Instagram. You can check them out at VaporsChoice.com. Uh, like I said, on checkout, if you want to try out any of these flavors, throw my name out on the, on the coupon and you'll save 25% to get you started. It's not a bad deal. Um, but regardless of anything else, Invasion Liquids, thank you guys so much. I'm impressed so far with the quality of your of your flavors and the blending technique that you guys are using. Um, definitely brings the flavors out a lot more, makes it a much more enjoyable, smoother vape. Uh, appreciate the, the privilege and the opportunity. I look forward to trying the rest of your line. As always, guys, I'm Token Vaping here on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat, Pinterest. Anything that I can do to help enhance your vaping experience. Anything that I can help you with to make it that much more enjoyable for you, by all means, please let me know. I will do everything I can to help you. Um, regardless of anything else, it's meant to be enjoyed. It's meant to be fun. It's meant to be um, a pleasant experience for you. And if I can help in any way, shape, or form with that, I definitely will. But as always, no matter what, always remember, vape on, vape strong, and have a good night.